the season of the wolf is drawing to its close. Spring is a season of violence and rebirth. A bison cow heads alone into a wolf-filled world. Only one instinct has the power to make her leave her herd. Labor moves quickly. She checks for life. It's a bull. He's 18 kilos of pure instinct. These first hours are critical. He should be on his feet in 10 minutes and in an hour ready to run. And he'll need to run. During his first year, his herd will migrate through the northern range, where wolves rule the turf like street gangs. Pursued by ravenous killers, this calf will be a constant target. Close to home, his own herd. One of the firstborn of the season, he's the object of their fascination. His mother fends off the more aggressive beasts, some 40 times his size. Storms haunt Yellowstone well into spring, giving predators an edge. The sacrifice of one calf means others will live, at least until the wolves grow hungry again. Come summer, Yellowstone's young thunder beasts begin survival training. Each calf may get only six months of his mother's undivided attention. He needs to pack on about 20 kilos per month to survive the coming winter. This feisty guy could be four years away from battling other bulls, but he's already sparring with his mother. It's all about the headbutt. Mum wallows in dust a bison trick to foil insects. During the rut or mating season, the big guys also do it to intimidate rivals. He gives it a good try, but there's not enough thunder in this beast. Then there's the ritual of rubbing off an old coat for the rutting season to come. But survival takes more than copying adults, as the calf is about to find out. The Druid Peak Pack is on the prowl. Thank you. 
path is oblivious to approaching danger. Moving in from downwind, the wolves scope out the edges of the herd. cutting them off from the rest of the group. Driving the lone pair up a ridge, the wolves press their advantage. Bison's kick sends a wolf airborne. With injuries, he'll be lucky to survive. The rest of the pack continues the attack. The calf could be doomed. The calf owes his life to the herd. With many powerful bison in most herds, they have the clout to defend their young. But for a calf, family life is full of surprises. Who knows when a nice wallow with mum will be interrupted? Bison herds follow a rigid hierarchy. Females on top. Older, more experienced cows rule. Younger In the valley where the bison graze, waters run fast, deep and treacherous. But better grazing lies beyond, and where a mother goes, her calf must follow. Bison are strong swimmers, nearly from birth, but sometimes the current is stronger. A young calf gets swept away. When his mother reaches shore, he's not at her side. He's far downstream, in trouble. The bank seems impossibly high. the strength. Still trailing his umbilical cord, this calf can't be more than two or three days old. One of the last bison born this season. He's got only a 50-50 chance of surviving the year. But his first challenge is by midsummer, each bison calf has grown closer to becoming a thunder beast. They've mastered the river crossing, and they're trading in their orange coats for the deep brown of the herd. A playful coyote teaches a calf the bison's stand and fight method of dealing with predators. In the season of plenty, it's all in good fun. But when a yearling joins the game, the coyote bows out. During the brief summer, Yellowstone's bison spend their waking hours fattening up for winter. And now there's a younger man trying to catch her eye. A first timer, four years old and all stoked up. What's his chance? When a cow in heat runs through the herd, chaos and fighting follow in her wake.
This older, more experienced cow can take her time selecting a stud. A calf doesn't know what to think. Oh my goodness. He's almost at the shore, Lisa. Okay, he is. He's okay. Bravo! Bravo! Oh.